Hi Pisces and welcome to my channel. So I'm doing a bonus reading for you all today because your general reading for the month was one of the most popular. So I'm glad that resonated with a lot of you. Welcome if you're new and if you're returning, thank you so much for your support. It's really appreciated. Remember this reading's general, so it won't resonate with all of you. Take what's yours and leave the rest. So I'm going to start with some whispers of healing, see if there's anything you might need to focus on at this time. So it's quite interesting, we've got um, six to seven there. Transition for some of you. First card says give back. So this could be something you want to do or you're being guided to do. Give back in some way to the community. Um, could be to people around you. Maybe someone needs you right now. Someone in your family or friends. I'm also feeling that, I'm, I'm feeling like a soul tribe energy here. Um, people from your past actually, past lives, who may come into your life if you've released other people or situations. They're actually being guided into your life, wow beautiful we got reawaken so for some of you this is reawakening some gifts within you hidden gifts I feel psychic gifts you are a very psychic spiritual intuitive sign Pisces um, I often feel that in readings This can also be a spiritual awakening, because we've got number seven there. And with the child, um, connecting with your inner child has helped you to do that. Um, we've also got a child in this card. It's quite interesting. And the message is answers within. So you have the answers within, Pisces, always trust that. It's like your inner child is trying to show you the way. There's a star there. Wish upon a star. So I'm also feeling with reawaken, reawaken things like talents as well. That maybe you used to love doing as a child. And giving back in some way with these gifts. So we've got transform. There's a transformation happening for a lot of you, we've got butterflies there. And again, the same sort of message because, I'm not sure if you can see, she's lifting up this glass lid and there's a tree there for spiritual growth and butterflies flying out. It's like you're, yeah, awakening something within yourself. Um, Spirit's really been helping you with this. A lot of personal spiritual growth, anyway. Coming out there. A lot of learning. And we've got an eight. 35 breaks down to an eight. It's a six, seven, eight. <laughs> you might be seeing numbers like that. Um, consecutive numbers. Always look them up. So let's take some tarot as well.
Wow, positive cards. I mean, first of all, we've got your energy with the moon and the nine of cups. This is showing your wishes will be fulfilled. Things haven't been as they seem. Feeling there's been like an illusion that maybe spirits placed there around you. And this was to help you reawaken and find the answers within. Lots of things are going to happen for you, Pisces. So have faith. Communication coming your way. Fast communication. Um, the Knight of Wands, though, is someone who could have been in your life already, could already be in your life right now. They don't always stick around. So this could just be someone who wants a good time, let's say, you know. Um, but not all is as it seems with the moon. Yeah, so Spirit's saying, really, again, your energy's come out here, first of all, with home men, but really assess this. Um, because you've got the King of Cups and the sun. I mean, two really positive cards in love in particular. I do feel this is someone you know already. They're in your heart. So if they come in like the, the Knight of Wands, that's why Spirit's saying, just take some time to go within and listen to how you feel, you know? Because um, I feel you could have a lot of happiness here. There's, there's a transformation that I feel is happening for some of you in, in connections. Um, and for some of you, if, if there is no one, then this is someone potentially coming in who makes you feel very happy, very loving energy here. For some of you, this is two people. Um, this could be someone who's from your past and you know what you want. So you might communicate with them, but you hold back. Yeah, because this is also showing hold, holding back. And then the real one comes in. <laughs> so this could be a test from the universe. It's really what I'm feeling with the moon. There's something happening here behind the scenes. Uh, so Leo, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay, they're, they're guiding me to take some of my key words for this reading as well. Anything else that might come through? So, a few different messages here. First of all, these three go together. Heartbreak, broken, tears. So this could be a past energy, or maybe quite recent. For some of you, you've needed to heal from some heartbreak. There's been a lot of purging. Yeah, which we're seeing with the moon, actually. Um, deep emotions there. There was something you really wanted um, in love, I feel in particular, and it didn't work out. There's a strong attachment for some of you um, with someone from your past, with this energy that's coming out there with a the heartbreak. It's interesting, boundaries is on the Knight of Wands, yeah, that links. <laughs> so this could be a lesson that you had to learn, you know, setting strong boundaries with people so that you, this heartbreak 
doesn't happen, you know, you're not strung along, let's say. But as I said, this could be the lesson, putting boundaries in place with this person this time around or this energy, even if, you know, if it's not someone you know. We've got roses as well, so they might bring you roses, sweet talk you. Um, again, trust your intuition, because there's a few different scenarios coming out here. For some of you, I feel this person is genuine. And they step up with the, you know, they come, come in first with some roses, tell you you're amazing. <laughs> and then they step up as the King of Cups and it's as if for some of you it's someone else here. The real one that comes in. So you're going to potentially feel amazing. Really feel that with, with the sun. And they've got videos. Interesting. Maybe there are some videos that could help some of you if you're feeling heartbreak heart chakra healing, music, um, or muse, um, sorry, videos that help you feel uplifted, you know, whether it's readings or just general videos online. Maybe some of you make videos. Um, something linked to this person with videos. Um, telling, yeah, they, they give you a message through a video, okay, it could even be a video call, okay, yeah, because we've got amazing men, they tell you you're amazing, I feel that's the King of Cups energy, opening up to you, wow, okay, let's take some romance angels as well, Free yourself, yeah, free yourself from that heartbreak, tears. It's time to take back control of your life. There could also be a situation that's making you feel stuck. There are secrets with the moon there. So, you know, again, whether it's present or past, take what resonates. Playfulness, so you're being guided to be playful with this new love, um, kind of seeing that here, a lot of happiness I feel. Um, and with reawaken, again, this links to the inner child, letting your inner child out, you know, having fun, shining. Okay, that one. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. Yeah, so that's why I feel this message came out um, with this Knight of Wands. You know, some of you may hold back a little bit, be unsure whether it's someone you know or not. And you're being guided to work at this because I'm seeing a divine love here for some of you. Take one more and flirt. <laughs> so we've got a lot of energy here of you just sort of opening up, letting your youthful energy shine, extending your light-hearted energy to others. And I'm, I'm just feeling this person's going to be so doting and loving and wonderful you're just going to feel so happy with the sun again <laughs> wow Pisces okay I really hope you've enjoyed this reading it's brought you some insight please do leave a comment if so like share and subscribe sending peace and light to you all